Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel, and this is a uh, update on the updates, the Patch Tuesday updates that seem to be rolling out well. First of all, so um, they are a little smaller than usual in the packages and what uh, they actually install because there's less to fix this month, and it's a welcome change to the record-breaking updates of the past few months. I wanted to talk about one very important flaw in there that needs to be patched by everybody and that is why you need to install those updates for uh, Patch Tuesday that was released yesterday October 13th 2020. So we talked a little bit about it in the video um, so there's a big big security flaw it is in what we call the TCP IP stack. This is where everything coming from the network and the internet is handled. So that's a key part of connectivity. And uh, what's happening is that um, a flaw was discovered. So Microsoft discovered it uh, itself with its security team. And they even actually uh, created a proof of concept showing um, different security companies how this can be exploited so that Security companies can mitigate it if they don't patch immediately. So there's a way to mitigate it, and there's a way to, of course, fix it. And the Patch Tuesday updates yesterday fix it. That's why if you have installed this, you're safe and you're okay. If you haven't, well, that's where it's dangerous. There's still no um, news of anybody using this, but because Microsoft demonstrated how easy it was, it's pretty sure that companies uh, that are bad guys or hackers out there will do everything in their power to actually exploit this. The way it works, they send a carefully crafted code through your connection. How do they do that? Well, simply putting it on a web page. So they go on a web page, you can have an ad, you can have a um, it could be on the web page, uh, simply a code within the page itself. When that perfect string of code is actually read through, what happens it is uh, it actually does a de denial of service uh, prompt, and then your computer will actually blue screen. It will do a blue screen of death. And this sequence of event is the possibility for remote code execution. So when you have instability in your system, that's where the hackers can actually inject the code they want. You restart and you're done because some malware, some ransomware is in your PC. So it is a big flaw because this morning, a lot of uh, security experts and big security companies all are saying, better patch this because this is extremely important it's easy to exploit it's sure to be exploited so that's why it is important people have the impression that antivirus you know that's where i often talk about antivirus they say oh well i have a good antivirus it's not going to be a problem your antivirus doesn't see that your antivirus will just look at the sequence of events going through you'll have a blue screen you don't know what happened but you already have the code injected in your PC. And then you think, well, my antivirus will find that code, and that's not the way it works. Your antivirus will probably not even see that code was injected. That's why I always say, stop relying on antivirus software. Windows security is enough. If you buy antivirus, you're wasting your money, and that's it. You're the security. And this is a perfect example of being exploited, and your, antivir your antivirus will actually have uh, no way of knowing and will not react to it. It's that way of being infected and that way of having uh, remote code execution that is making antivirus pretty much useless in the most part. And so here, like I always say, what's the best and safest thing to do? Be careful where you go on the internet. But make your updates. Do your updates. And if you do your security updates from Patch Tuesday yesterday, you're safe. You already did what is required to stay safe. So uh, do so because it's very important on this uh, security flaw. 
If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.